So I'm going to share the scripture this morning and um, also some reflections from Soren Kierkegaard, who is a Danish um, theologian and philosopher, 1847. He wrote this book, Works of Love, which I first read when I was in seminary in 1983. You can see my copy. The cover's gone. It was actually printed in 62, so the book's as old as I am. So what can you say? But anyway, um, this is kind of one of those works that I've come back to again and again and again. And it's a really challenging word in many ways. But it's a really stretchy word, and I keep coming back to it because it speaks to me and calls to me. So these words are familiar ones that, again, we often hear at weddings. Love is patient. Love is kind. Love is not envious or boastful or arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrongdoing, but rejoices in the truth. It bears all things, believes all things hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. But as for prophecies, they will come to an end. As for tongues, they will cease. As for knowledge, it will come to an end. For we know only in part, and we prophesy only in part, but when the complete comes, the partial will come to an end. When I was a child, I spoke like a child, I thought like a child, I reasoned like a child. When I became an adult, I put an end to childish ways. For now we see in a mirror dimly, but then we will see face to face. Now I know only in part, then I will know fully, even as I have been fully known. And now faith and hope and love abide these three, and the greatest of these is love. <laughs> 